Signal received, Mandalore. The proton core is active. We still need to set three more charges. Mandalore, we are holding our position, but the Sith appear to be offering little resistance. It's like they don't even realize we're here. Thank <laughs> you. 
reach one of the target sites. Arming signal received, Mandalore. Only one proton core remains to be set. We're encountering heavy resistance. I don't know how long we can hold out. What the hell was that? I told you to wait! Mandalore, we've made contact with the enemy, and one of the cores has detonated prematurely. Was it in the target zone? No, Mandalore. We have failed you. I offer you my... Do we have another core? No, Mandalore. Even with the other two cores set in the ship, it will not be sufficient to destroy the vessel. We need to find another proton core, or we need to make one. All right, wait for my signal. This isn't over. And don't kill yourself before I tell you. Have you come to kill me? You Jedi are masters of cruelty. Letting me take back my home. There is nothing to be done except wait. It was a strange sensation. Perhaps. I have questions. You fought with... You thought we all... We thought... What did you... Fair enough. Ever consider this? We look... I... I suppose we'll... Ne now is there some...
This door leads to my cell. I had forgotten. No, there are no weapons. It was a place where I could center myself from the agony on board this ship. I do not have pleasant memories of it. If there is time, I would like to center myself. There... Where once there was a world that was strong in the Force, now there is a barren wasteland. From the death of an entire world comes great power. My hands shall be hate, my eyes revenge. You shall be avenged, and the one who has done this shall die. There's nothing more for me here. of the Mandalore. We can destroy the ship on your command. Thank <laughs> you. 
This door leads to the bridge and my former master. If you wish to gather your strength, this is the last time.
will try. I saw a graveyard world, surrounded by a fleet of dead ships. I felt it through him, as I feel it through you. You are my master now, and I will follow wherever your path takes you. My path is at an end. You all right? Get away from me. I don't need your help. Just leave me here. Candorus, the Force lies in all living things. I have watched my people die. You will survive. You have no choice. You have been wounded before and lived, Mandalorian. Rise. Many battles do you still have left in you. You sound like Revan. What he told me in those last days on the Outer Rim. <laughs> that the Mandalorian Wars were our doom, and that we had been deceived. That it had never been our decision to wage war on the Republic. Revan said the Mandalorians didn't invade the Republic space ten years ago because it was our choice. We were tricked. Our entire people sacrificed as pawns. and never knew it. He said there was a war coming, that it was waiting out in the unknown regions, in the dark, waiting for us to destroy each other. A war? This war? No, not this one. Another one. More terrible. Against an evil we couldn't begin to comprehend. A war of belief that had been fought for thousands of years. Revan went off to fight it. And left you here. Revan was one of the greatest military leaders in the galaxy. In history, he knew what he was doing. And I always follow orders.
Admiral Onasi wanted to speak with you, sir. As I understand it, there was something concerning a uh, mutual... It's a little beat up, but it's still home. I wasn't able to be here to protect it when the Sith attacked the first time. This time you gave me a second chance. I owe you. I've read your records, how the Jedi sentenced you, and doing what you believed. You wandered past the Outer Rim during your exile. I ask you, did you find any trace of Revan? I served with him, like you did. And we had to part ways, like you did. He said that there were places where he had to walk where I could not go. Places where having allies, or anyone he cared about, would only place them in danger. It's been four years, and I still don't know what happened to him. He told me to stay here to try to keep the Republic strong, and that he would return. It was the hardest request I ever had to follow. I don't know, but it was important to him. He said that he believed something had been behind the Mandalorian Wars, that it hadn't been the Mandalorian's choice to attack the Republic. Whatever it was, I think he went off to find it to fight it. It was near the end of the Jedi Civil War when it seemed like we met on a Republic warship called the Endar Spire. It was being attacked over Terrace, and the Sith had stormed the ship. We saved the Republic. But it was... And I think he finally remembered something terrible that he'd done. He left a lot of people who cared about it. But whatever he set out to do, I... And here you return. With his ship. Without him. Yes. Wherever he went, your ship's been there. If... If you return... No. Simply tell him that Admiral Onassi is following his orders. Safe journey, Exile. Did he know? No, he didn't. There are times I fear we shall never know where he left Karth, and I cannot live not knowing the answer. Why he sought to protect us. He asked us to stay to keep the Republic safe. It was important to him, and after meeting the Exile, I'm convinced that there are worse things to lose in the galaxy. left us all when he lost all that he loved at Malachor V. We go now, my master, to that dark place which made you, where you gained your ship, your troops, your ship, my prison, that you dragged from the gravity well at Malachor V. Wish I'd never met him. 
Wish I'd died there, but the storms have dragged me down into Malachor V. We will not surrender. We will not die, like we did on Malachor V. Your command echoes still, General, and I obey, as I did at Malachor V. Now Malachor V comes to us, and I wish to face it this last time. You know where you must go. It calls to you still. It is the heartbeat of the past. And she must be stopped. There. Now. Or she will bring the screams of Malachor V to the galaxy, just as we carry the Echo all this way. It has been some time. You were a fool to return. I spared you once. I will not do so again. Spare me? Ah, yes. No, you simply did not learn the lesson I sought to teach. That your strength is as meaningless as the strength of my hand. Quiet! Have you returned? Because now I understand why the Exile did what he did. There is much to be done. Master, he is here. I know. What is thy bidding, my master? You are to do nothing. When he arrives, bring him before me. He will not survive Malachor. What will you do with him, my master? You know what I shall do. You, who wear my teaching so well. I will break him. He is a blank slate upon which my teachings may be written, as I intended for you so long ago. Leave me. Await the arrival of the exile. When he comes, bring him before me.